guys, Run with Craft Scissors here with another plan with me. This one is in my recollections planner. We're doing January 8th through the 14th. I went ahead and put down the date covers, did my wide out and my headers because that saves a little bit of time um, for you guys and for me because I feel like I'm I'm always having to like readjust my headers because I'm talking. So this is the clips that I'm going to use with this spread. I like the diamond one because I feel like there's a lot. See all those like cut lines? It just gives it like a kind of a diamondy feel to me. I don't know. I used to have a pink glitter heart, but I sold out of those, and I haven't had time to restock, so thank you. <laughs> um, and then this pink, um, dark pink glittery um, coffee cup or hot cocoa, I felt like kind of went with this spread. This spread is called School. That's what the kid is called. Sorry, not the spread. Um, so I thought, okay, that'll work. And then there's a coffee cup, like here, and then I think in the deco, yeah, there's another coffee cup there. So I thought that went. It'll go for now. Anyway, until I decide... To do something else <laughs> okay so let's get started I already started a little don't be mad okay so I always do my full boxes at the top and this kits from pomegranate sticker co I'm not sure if I said that and you can use code RWCS 25 for 25% off okay so I like full boxes then half boxes then checklists full box half box checklist okay I'm ready all right my theme sticker I was trying to decide between the globe and the pen cup and I think that I'm gonna go with the pen cup no I'm gonna go with globe let's go with globe I don't really have a reason I don't know okay so this is a perfect spread because actually not this week but the week I'm currently in um, was the first day back for second semester I'm a teacher in case you're new to my channel welcome <laughs> I'm a teacher so Sometimes I talk about my teachery stuff. Sorry. It's my life. There you go. And then, um, so next week is actually our first full week back. So that's why I thought this would be appropriate to use now instead of waiting until next fall. And I also thought there's some people, you know, like college students and stuff and um, even some like moms and stuff might want to do a school spread for their kid going back to school after Christmas break. I don't know. So I thought it would be fun to do. Anyhow, I like how the black seems kind of chalkboardy. I don't know if you guys see that, but I feel like it is. I don't have a chalkboard, we have whiteboards. And I have a smart board, which I don't use because it doesn't work with the new technology they gave us with our teacher devices. And boy, technology, I'm gonna be venting for a little bit because it has been a rough three days back to school. Um, my um, teacher device is like one of those computers where like the top detaches or whatever so it like wide eye I think that's what it's called connects to my projector okay so it's supposed to be this magical thing that it's like I can connect it I can um, put um, duplicate screen or extended screen for doing stuff and it's fantastic well the problem is my computer is disconnecting from it over and over on its own like it's losing connection and then when I go to like reconnect it doesn't even register that my projector is there so I can't even connect to it yeah that's how my week has been going so if you're a teacher and you're having to deal with technology you probably can totally relate to me right now but if you're not you're probably like what are you talking about so that's all I'm gonna say about that is that it's been kind of a rough week because of technology for me okay so I pulled a bunch of different washies I'm probably not gonna use all of these I'm gonna say probably because occasionally I do that so these I just bought these two I got them for 59 cents at Hobby Lobby. They were on clearance. And I thought because of the hashtags and the cameras, it would be kind of cute because it's like, okay, well, there's school pictures plus kids take pictures at school all the time. And then the hashtags, hashtag yes, hashtag awesome. That's kind of school related. Then I liked the pink and gold. But then I liked this pink and gold because it was planner. This is planner society. This is Michael's. This is Hobby Lobby in case you're like, where is she getting all these? Um, so that's where they're all from, but this pink doesn't match this pink. So that's my clash right there of trying to figure out what I'm going to do. I'm not sure. Um, but I think for the top, I really want to go with the light pink bow, this one, for up here. So I'm going to go ahead and throw that down real quick because I think I've decided on that at least. I think it's their rose gold though. It's like little rose gold bows. Okay, so I think that's what they are. Plus, bonus, the Planner Society kit for December actually kind of matches this kit. Because see that globe? Okay, well, she put the globe as her sticky notes. So, 
I thought I might incorporate that somehow. And then even the um, deco stickers. I know I stopped mid-washy. Just, I'm a squirrel. So, um, I thought these would be cute too in this spread. Like, it's got the pinks in it. So, I might use some of these in this spread as extra deco. Where's my washi cutter? There it is. That's actually what I was looking for. And then I was talking, so I just kept, like, going. I don't know. And that rattling is my sleeve constantly touching my tweezers that I use to put down the date covers which that one's not sticking <laughs> I'm not sure so there you go so if you miss me doing the headers or you're new to planning and you want to watch me do the headers my older videos a couple weeks ago honestly um, I used to do that with you guys so I just changed it up to save some time okay so I want to do this one I think I'm gonna do the hashtag awesome hashtag yes at the bottom I'm not so sure about the cameras I'm really not but I like them because they're black and white and there's a lot of black in the spread and so that's why I picked it and now I'm like regretting my decision <laughs> is what's happening so okay that it got really wrinkled and I'm not gonna be able to save that so plus it's half of awesome <laughs> so I'm gonna go like this and I think that'll look really cute. But it's so funny because I literally bought this washi today and I was filming tonight. And I do not remember like what I plan on filming. I didn't remember. I just thought, oh, this is cute. And for 59 cents, yes. Because you know my rule is a dollar a roll. So that was even less. So win for me. Anyway, there was another roll I wanted that was kind of actually chalkboardy, but she said it wasn't getting marked down to 59 cents. It was two something. And I was like, well. I'll pass because it's not like I need it. <laughs> yeah. Do I ever need washi? <laughs> Sometimes, honestly. Sometimes I don't have the right washi to go with something. Okay, and then I tear it a little bit off and you leave that sticky. And then when you go to wrap it around, you can stick it to itself again and then you're all good. But for right now, it's just a hot mess. And that's how that goes. Um, so I think I'm going to pick a skinny washi for the top half. Not the bows, because I just used that. I was thinking these, because of all the cut lines. There's not polka dots in this spread, so. I just pulled them all, because they all coordinate. And there's really not much left on this. I'm not sure why. I guess I used a lot. I don't remember. I don't remember. <laughs> it's not up there anymore. Oh, are you still sticky? I've had that happen, actually. Washi, like, stop being sticky. It's like, I'm like, okay, did you get too close to the heater or you just wore out? I mean, I guess the sticky can dry up. So be aware of that, especially my scotch. I have some scotch brand washi that I ended up throwing out. I went to like go use it and it like did not work at all. It didn't, it wasn't sticky at all. And even this isn't very sticky. I guess you could glue it, but I hate putting glue on my planner because it gets the page kind of wet. And... Anyway. <laughs> That's just me. <laughs> so we'll see how that works out. It seems to be staying down now that I pushed it down. Who knows? Okay. So there's these like full half boxes and then like a little bit smaller half boxes. So I use both. And then in this planner, I think I do like to have a half box on the side. Yeah, I do. So I want to start off with the little ones so that I end up with a leftover big one. So I'm going to go with this. And I think this should fit pretty well. It'll have a little bit of a gap on the top and the bottom on the smaller boxes and then it won't have a gap at all on the bigger ones. Oh, I don't want to use that because it's neutral. I want to use a pink one. It matches the header better. You're probably like, why does that matter? Because it does. <laughs> okay, and then this black one will go over here. So I just kind of eyeball it. Which if you're new to planning might be a little hard because you are not used to it, but it'll work. You'll get there. Okay, then I'm gonna use this one because it has the clipboard. So it matches. And then what you don't wanna do is line it up with those dotted lines because they don't meet. There's a slight gap, so as far as that goes. Um, we'll use this one because it matches. I'm trying to do it kind of straight, there you go. And then this one is a full box. I think I'm gonna keep the globe one for the sidebar because it'll match my theme sticker. 
So I'm going to do that. And then I'll do a swirly one. There. Awesome. Okay, so then I have that for there. And then I have some quarter boxes. And then I never end up using these checklists. Um, you could if you wanted more white space, but she includes checklist full boxes. So I just prefer to use those as far as what I do. So that's where we're going next is the full box checklist. Now this planner, if you're new to watching me, you don't know, so I'm going to go over this. Um, this is my YouTube and PR planner. So it actually doesn't have anything to do with school. Someone asked me to do a teacher edition plan with me. And I have a teacher planner, but it's not one that I don't think you can really buy. Like my work buys them in bulk from some distributor. So I feel bad like showing it because people will be like, where can I buy this? And I'm like... I don't know because I didn't actually pay for it either and I literally put washi down and then some deco stickers and that's it and then you see like what I'm planning to do in my lessons throughout the week so I just feel like it's kind of boring I've done a couple of them but then I was like maybe because they were they commented that on my Erin Condren plan with me and I was like maybe they think I'm gonna get an Erin Condren teacher edition because I don't have one of those and I don't know that it would work for me because I teach, okay, I teach four, I teach three different subjects and I teach five classes, um, six if you count the study hour one, because I put that in there and I put that, that has its own box in my teacher planner because um, I have to know whether it's open for travel or closed for travel, like to go to different classrooms, whether the kids can go or not. Okay, so I have an extra checklist, which will probably go in the sidebar and then a Monday through Sunday, which is good for meal planning, but not for this planner. And then I have these little half box to do's, um, to buys and to cleans, which I don't usually end up using those. So it's just kind of like how the kit works for you, right? Okay, let's go ahead and do the bottom washi. Okay, so that was on the date cover sheet. And then there's deco on here too, but we'll do the bottom washi and then we'll finish out the sidebar. As far as that goes, is this gonna hang over? No. Okay, good. <laughs> I was like, that's new. All right. I think it did a little bit. Oh, well. I'll trim it down if it bugs me. I'm not going to rip it back up because that's annoying. <laughs> yeah, I need to go up a little bit. Okay. There we go. Yeah. Perfect. Okay. So then I have some deco stickers on here. We'll come back from that. We'll come back to that. Back from that. <laughs> Let's throw the weekend banner down just to finish out the rest of that spread. And then there's some functionals on there, most of which I can't use in this planner. So if you have any questions about YouTube, I like to answer those during this video too. As far as sidebar headers, okay, so I like my this week. Um, there's a this week header. Oh, let's add some washi. I like to add washi from the kit when I go over this direction. I'm going to do this one. Because it's the same as the bottom washi. So I'm incorporating it back into the spread up there. I just got quiet. Sorry. <laughs> um, that's what happens when I'm focusing. I'm trying to make things straight. And then I haven't gotten into my nails. Um, I'm going to my nail appointment tomorrow. So normally my nails are um, done as well. I broke a couple. It's been, like I said, a rough week. <laughs> I'm just kidding. I don't really care if my nails break. It is what it is. They'll grow back. <laughs> oh, sorry. I can't even see the spread. <laughs> I do that. I lay my stickers there. Because I'm not sure if you want to see the sheets or my spread. I feel like I would rather see the spread if I was watching. I'd be like, quit covering up the spread. Okay, back to the washi sheet. I think I'm going to grab the hearts. No, you can't really see. I'm going to do the swirl. The pink swirl. And pop that hot pink in there. It's cute. Okay, and then I like to do a goals. Is there a goal sticker? No, so we'll just do a little heart flag. And then we'll grab that half box that I mentioned earlier. I knew it was black, so that's why I picked a pink header. And I knew that was light pink, and so this one's the darker one. You just kind of coordinate how you want. If you want it all the same color, I like it a little mixy matchy so that the sidebar kind of blends in with the rest of the spread. That's just me. You do you. 
That's how I feel about planning. <laughs> okay, let's grab this one. No, it's kind of plain. No, I don't want to do the black one. Let's do the stripe, I guess. It's fun. Okay, and then I put a habit tracker down for Instagram. Where's that? There it is. She always puts one in her kits. I feel like I remember when people started putting those in their kits. I remember I had, um, I bought individual sheets of those because they weren't in kits. And then they started putting them in kits and it was like, well, now I don't need these extra sheets. So what am I supposed to do now? <laughs> right? <laughs> Planner girl struggle. Okay. Sometimes I grab the same washi all the way to the bottom. This time I didn't. That's new. I change it up every once in a while. It's good to do that. Okay. So what do we need to do next? functionals okay so this planner I have a lot of plan with me's so that's what we're gonna take care of first My extra functionals are in the back um, if you hear a little squeak when I touch the page it's because it is glossy so there's that okay I like my little Loretta girl from my Instagram habit tracker it's from cupcakes and stickies you can use code Leslie 15 for 15 percent off she has a whole bunch of social media ones okay then I want um, $2 Tuesday is coming back to Cupcakes and Stickies this Tuesday, so I need that sticker. And then I have my planner sticker. She does have one camera in the kit, so I'll use that for spread picks. Um, I'll do that for um, before the pen, because I've been doing that a lot, before the pen picks on Monday. And then Wednesday is midweek spread pick. I'm going to use this black one. That's from Britannia. And then I'm going to use a pink one, I'll use the light pink one, um, for Sunday for end of the week. So there's before the pen, midweek, and then end of the week. I think that'll be good. Okay, and then planner, plan with me. Okay, so I plan, I like to do that right there, because then I'll use the sticker to cover up that flag that's sticking out. And then she has a planner in the sheet right there. So I plan in this plan, I plan in the Erin Condren on Mondays. Hmm. So EC, plan with me. And then Wednesdays, Wednesdays, I'm trying to color coordinate, we'll see if I can. <laughs> Covering up the heart. Oh well, you can still see it down there. <laughs> okay, Wednesdays is my mini happy planner. So I'm going to use this one from Sticker Monster Co. This is Jacqueline. So she's going to go right there. And this is my mini happy planner plan with me. And no, I haven't done a planner lineup video. I feel like I've already like two weeks in, so I don't know if I should. <laughs> you can voice your opinion on that. I don't know. All right, where'd the one go? There it is. Okay, then Saturday and Sunday. Yeah, I'm not going to be able to coordinate. So Saturday, I film my recollections plan with me. So I like to use one of these from the Gucci project. We'll use... None of these really match. I guess we'll use the multicolored one. I know these are supposed to be in Aaron Condren, but... I use that one, so we we'll use this one for this one. R E C plan with me, and then the last little quarter box on this sheet is pink, so it doesn't fully coordinate. And I want to bring it down here because I don't want to. Well, I like the coffee cup more than I like the. I don't know if that's a mirror or magnifying glass. That thing. I don't know. <laughs> what I'm covering up. <laughs> I don't know. Okay, then Happy Planner Plan With Me, because my Happy Planner is in a cover like this. So that's why I like these ones. I'm going to go with the hot pink to kind of bring in some of that hot rose color. Okay, so then this is Happy Planner Plan With Me Design Group, because that's my collab video that I do every Sunday. Okay, so that's all done. And then the middle, all I do is write down my subs on YouTube. So I track those. Sometimes um, you'll see a dip if you're um, new to um, YouTube. Sometimes YouTube cleans out dead accounts and then you lose some subscribers. And that's okay. You're going to lose and gain 
um, every day. Well, maybe not every day, but as your channel gets bigger. So don't take offense if people unsubscribe because sometimes they just deleted their whole ch their whole like profile. And you'll have people that watch you that don't even have a um, an account. So okay. So as far as other functionals here, I can't think of what I would be using. There's a cute little coffee cup and a payday, but that's not applicable. She has little flags for the Erin Condren. I don't think I need any of that. Okay, that's done. That's done. That's done. I'm going to put goals. And then I do one for YouTube and Instagram. But I'll do that like the night before on Sunday. So I don't know yet. And then I like to use these cute little stickers to remember to post. So I put that there. These are from Plano Love SP, and I just like them as kind of like extra deco for my box. This here. Picks. Post. I just like them. There. Now I used up some of those. And it's my header sheet. I don't think I need that. I think we're good to go with deco now. I think I did all my functionals. Where's my deco? Oh, I need to do this. Um, my silly holiday sheet. Then I need to find what I did with the deco sheet. Because it got under something. There it is. I found it. And we also have the Planner Society deco. Lots of deco in this spread. Okay, so these are silly holidays. These are the January ones from Cupcakes and Stickies. She already has the... February ones out so you can check that out she did make them a little bit smaller and then there's like a little chart to follow so I thought I would use them up every week and then I'll put this in my January spread at the end of the month so we are on the 8th and the 8th is bubble bath day Ooh, I want to participate in that okay and then the 9th is balloon day and then the 10th is houseplant day I have a house plant. It's a bamboo plant. It's in my bathroom. Had it for years. Okay, the 11th is milk day. I'm not a big milk drinker. Unless there's cookies or cereal, I'm not a person that's like, oh, I really want a big glass of milk. That's not a thing for me. But I like eggnog like that. I don't know. 12 is hot tea day. My mom loves tea. And then Saturday, the 13th, is sticker day. So she has a little cupcakes and stickies. Sticker. Envelope of stickers. I'm going to that over there so we can keep see the roses okay and then sunday the 14th is kite day which always makes me think of that peanuts movie the charlie brown one where he's like the kite tree is sleeping so now i can try out my kite it's like the tree that always sucks away is anyway <laughs> you guys are probably like what <laughs> i watch a lot of movies <laughs> okay so here is the deco i want to put this deco where do i want to put this deco I think I'm going to scatter it because I kind of want to use the Planner Society Deco too, but I'm trying to decide. I think these are too big. Those are definitely too big and not really school related. I feel like the coffee cup and the laptops and the mouse pad and stuff like that are all related and the pen, so I want those in there. And I like how it has roses on it. I'm like, perfect. Okay, so there's... Some that don't have deco in there. So I can do that. And we'll put a little glow over here. And there's a pin. Put that on that box. And then I think this is a little ruler. And then there's scissors. So cute. And then there's little glasses. And then there's itty bitty little paper clips. And then there's bigger paper clips too. And then there's a little rose. And there's, I'm going to call it a mirror. But it seems really tiny. I'm not sure. Oh, it's right there. I don't want to put that there. No, we'll do it right there. And then there's a pen. Another pen. Okay, and then there's itty bitty little tiny paper clips, which I'm not going to bother with because they're too tiny for me. There's even one right there, too. She squeezed as many as she could. Okay, so then I'm going to grab this one. So 
Which one do I want to use? Do I want to use the bow clips? What was my plan? Okay, I want to use the laptop. Because I'm definitely like working on my laptop. Because that's what we use at work. I'm going to put that down there. And then we'll pretend that this is my off fancy chair at my, de at my desk. I don't have that fancy of a chair. But we're going to pretend. And then, see, there's a, that looks like a magnifying glass. There's a little tray of stuff to like grade and work on. That can be fun. Not really. Grading's probably like my least favorite thing. Because honestly, though, I'm I'm pretty good at keeping up with my grading because it drives me nuts when like I get behind. And I guess that's a good thing. Okay, we'll do big scissors. There's a pen. Where is that going to go? Up there? There. And then there's a little pin. There's a bow. It's cute. And then there's some roses. You can throw those in there. Up top would actually be really cute like that. I think. I'm trying to incorporate this kit into here. I only write down a number, so I don't need like the whole spread. The alarm clock, I have to get up early for work. We'll put that over here. And then there's a mouse pad, because I work at my desk. There's an itty bitty little bow. There's some more flowers. Where do I want to put this one? That one up there. And then it's a little bit on Jacqueline's head, but I think she'll be okay. And then there's another. See, now I feel like it's a magnifying glass. But before I was like, maybe it's a little mirror. <laughs> Who knows? Because I don't. Okay, and then there's one more little desk chair, and I kind of want to use it because I used everything else. So I just have to figure out where I'm going to put it. <laughs> right there. Do I have room to write subs? Yeah, yeah. We're covering up a little bit of little bits, but that's okay. So I didn't use this sheet. I just used this one, so that's okay. So I still have two sheets left over, and then I think I shared one with someone. So there's that. And then I thought I could use sticky notes this week. I want to leave those on my desk to use with the spread, so that'll be fun. And I think I used pretty much all of that sheet. A couple on that one. I can continue to use those. Sometimes I use different stickers to cover up the icon. There's three more quarter boxes on here in washi. There's flags, quarter boxes, and um, checklists. And then there's a bunch of functionals. So there's the leftovers of what I have left of the kit. We'll go ahead and put the clips on. And then I'm pretty much done with this spread. So I hope you guys like how I incorporated some planner society. I hope that wasn't like too random. But I was just like, oh my gosh, it's the globe. I don't know. I just kind of went with it. So there you go. So that's my spread this week. I hope you guys like it. Um, give this video a like. Please subscribe. And I will see you guys in my next video. Bye. Yes, I waved. <laughs>